today for the new gang prevention facility for Homeboy Industries. You might recall the Homeboy Bakery fire destroyed the old building years ago, putting the bakery out of business. Eyewitness News reporter John Gregory is live in downtown L.A. with a look at the new facility. John? Kathy, they're planning a big grand opening later today, but they already have the ovens running, the bread is baking, and it smells pretty good in here right now, as you can imagine. Uh, take a look at this facility. It really is beautiful. As you mentioned, the original Homeboy Bakery burned down about eight years ago. This new facility cost about $8 million to build, all of it coming from private donations. And, of course, the goal here is not just to make baked goods, but also to change lives. And those involved in this program of getting gang members off the streets say it does make a difference. It's incredible because like, I never thought I would be a baker. I mean, all my years that I, what I've been through, I mean, doing this now, it's, uh, it's an experience that I couldn't believe I'll be doing. They tell us they have about 200 former gang members taking part in the Homeboy Bakery program, getting involved, getting off the streets. They also have a home girl cafe at the same location, and that is for former gang members, female gang members, and that too is helping them lead productive lives, do something other than the gang activity. This facility is located in Chinatown, and for one reason, it's kind of neutral territory for the gang members. There are no gangs that claim this turf, and if you're a former gang member trying to get out of a gang, that's important. You certainly don't, certainly don't want to be crossing into somebody else's turf to try and get out of a gang. It could certainly lead to problems. So that's why we're in Chinatown. It's a neutral area for these folks, and it looks like it's going to be pretty successful. It's quite a facility. We are live in Chinatown. John Gregory, ABC7 Eyewitness News.